What's up everybody, welcome back to How It's Done. Today we're gonna to be showing you how to change out a recess can and swap it over from something like this into something like this. Today on How It's Done. What's up everybody, welcome back to How It's Done. Today we're gonna to be showing you how to convert a recess can into a light fixture. So here we've got a recess can above the bathtub. We're gonna be converting it into a chandelier. Um, in order to do that, it's not just a direct swap because there's not actually a box up here, there's a opening. So we're gonna to have to convert it to a uh, box using a little conversion kit. Um, and then it's gonna have a little baffle that goes around the top because the hole's obviously gonna be bigger than the trim for the light fixture. So we'll show you how to do all that. All right, so first thing you gotta do is take your trim down. Normally it's just a couple clips. Sometimes you might have to pull it, but once you got the trim down, we'll go ahead and get the light bulb out of there. So once you open up this uh, conversion kit, you're gonna have a bracket that the box, or I'm sorry, the uh, bracket for your light fixture is gonna get attached to. You'll have an adapter to go from your socket to a wired setup. You'll have the baffle. You're gonna have a metal flange. You have instructions, so we don't need those. You got me, you don't need instructions. And if you're interested in seeing what this is, this is basically it. It's just a recessed light converter. Um, super duper easy to do, super easy to install. So we're gonna go ahead and take this, screw this up there. We're gonna go ahead and make sure that the power is off to this um, by turning off the light switch. And then uh, we'll screw this in, and then we'll screw this bracket on there. So we took these two screws out, um, out of either side, and then we put a screw on the side here and a screw in the side here so that this is centered. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna put this back on um, using these two screws and this washer is gonna go on this side to account for the difference in depth because of this. All right, so once you got that bracket on there, you are gonna go ahead and take this little metal clip and press it up underneath your uh, recess can housing and tighten it down so that this uh, bracket you've got here can be bonded to the existing can and everything is bonded and grounded correctly. So from here basically I took this uh, metal flange and put it up there and just twisted it a little bit so that the corners kind of lock underneath there. Um, you're going to need to make sure that these holes are clear because that's where the screws are going through. You're going to need your bracket from your new light fixture to sit on top of this and then that's just going to go right in there like that all right and then it's up there so that's pretty much how that works all that remains is to wire up the fixture attach it to this and finish hanging the fixture now I will say this is gonna be a little bit tricky because you see getting this screw in the side uh, it's gonna take a little bit of work because you don't have a lot of space to work with so it is gonna be a little tricky. It's gonna take a little bit of time and patience. Um, definitely don't wanna do this with the super heavy light fixture. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much all there is to it. 